Hi and welcome to Tran and TV. My name is Ed Miles and this is the new for 2013 Daytona Evo Voltex Gore-Tex boot. It's a dual construction boot, so you've got the inner part of the boot and the exterior part of the boot. I'll go into a bit more detail about that later. First of all, the exterior of the boot. On the exterior of the boot, you've got a titanium covered slide on the, on the front of the boot, for obviously for sports use. Full leather construction on the outer, three different colourways, the white and red, black and silver, and a black black colourway as standard. If you look at the sole of the boot, we've got full raised sole, so it's a thinner sole, unlike the other Daytona boots that are mostly for touring, you've got a thin sole to give you the maximum amount of feel through the pegs when you're racing a bike, doing track days, or even fast road riding. If you turn the boot over, on the base of the sole, you've got a non-slip sole, very, very thin again, to try and keep the amount of feel through the pegs as high as possible. Spin the boot back up, around the heel area, we've got a carbon plate. What we found with our sports boots, we've been doing dual compound boots for a very long time, we found that pegs quite often go through this area in the event of an accident because you're riding on the balls of your feet, you low side down, the peg can hit this area or on the other side. So that just gives a bit more protection around that area from the pegs going through. And so full leather construction, plastic side is in two places down the top and the, and the midpoint of the boot, covered in leather again for more protection. As you can see, throughout the, throughout the boot it's double stitched, so there's lots of protection in the boot, very, very strong outer. And a soft rail on the inside of the boot for extra grip on the bike, also to protect your swing arm if it ever rubs against that area. Spinning back around, you've obviously got your gear change pad on the toe on the toe as well. Finally on the outside, if I open up the zip here, you can see that as with all daytime boots, we've got a curved zip. The curved zip is stronger than the straight zip because if you have an accident and the zip starts to pull apart, it will stop pulling down here, less chance of the boot coming off in the event of an accident. Open it up again, you've got full calf adjustment on the back. Again, as with all daytime boots, you've got the calf adjustment there if you've got a bigger size calf. The front of the boot, as you can see, Fully formed uh, shin guard to uh, give you the protection there that you need when you're racing, again, track days or in the event of an accident. Put that back around, just show you the inner part of the boot. The inside of the boot is exactly the same as the Evo Sports Gore Tex that some of you may know. So you've got full Gore Tex in, right to the top of the boot, no problems with leaking, no problems with any of that, two year warranty on the waterproofing, one year warranty on the manufacturer. Straight down the outside of the inner, we've got a full PU uh, area down here with a hinge stocket here. This gives you the lateral support you need, again, in the event of an accident. You've got a suede over the top here, and also uh, a cotton lining that allows the sweat to absorb and get out of the boot as quickly as possible, so it increases the breathability of the boot as well. Finally, on the exterior of the boot, while we've got them apart, if we just open this up, I don't know if you can see on the inside of the sole, but you've got a full galvanised shank in there. If you do need to see any close-ups of that, there is more information on the website, www.tranam.co.uk, Evo Sports Gore-Tex boot, Voltex Gore-Tex boot is the premium racing boot for road riding, fast track riders and racers.